Hey, Drew. Coach Blake here. Glad to see you're able to get outside, continue working on your swing. I know it's uh, I know it's tough for all of us kind of continuing to work out or whatever it is that we want to do and social distance and everything that comes with that. And so great to see that you're outside and, you know, still working at it, still getting better, still taking every opportunity that you can to get better. So that's great. Love the uniform too, by the way. It was going to be great to see us in that uni. I still really believe we're going to all be in those unis in in a in a month or so. I'm you know, for me I'm thinking July and I think we'll start to be a little later than you know we anticipated, but it'll be a similar amount of baseball just later than we normally get it and and you're going to get that opportunity to put that uniform on uh in a real game. So, let's get to your swing. And one big concept I want to hammer home here is how to create power, okay? And we're going to do that by watching one of the best hitters in baseball. So let's watch him. So as he swings, gets in, he gets, he does this big leg kick. I'm not, I'm not telling you to do that. What I am telling you is you have to get your weight into your backside. All right, so let's go forward here with you. So we never get into this backside. So this is your load, right? You never really bring that weight back. All right, and I'm going to show you why that's important. You're bringing the weight back because you want to bring all that weight into the ball. Okay, so so we're here, and he wants Mike Trout. That is wants to bring that weight into the ball. All right, now watch how he does this. So we're gonna we're gonna play this forward. Watch his backside as we go forward. Watch the launch. The launches from his backside into his front side. That creates momentum and power into the ball. All right. If you never go back though, it's very hard to get that that kind of capture that weight and then go forward. So we want to go back and then go forward. Now, here you are and as we go forward, it's just kind of a bounce. We don't really launch. And I think the way you can fix that is if, is if you bring your weight back more first. Really get into that load a little more and think of it as a launch. Now as you go forward, let's watch. You do a good job. See, so you have the firm front side. That side's going to capture that weight, Drew. So if you go back and launch into the ball and, and you lock out like you do, you're going to capture the weight. So you'll be able to capture that momentum. We, what, we, what we need you to do, though, is get the momentum moving forward into the ball. You can do that, Drew. It's going to help you as the field gets bigger. Some of those hits are going to need to be harder. You're going to need to, to be able to generate more power because this field is going to be is, is going to be big, and you need to grow your swing into that field. So that's what I want you to do. Really work on your load, work on that transfer of weight. I can't wait to see you again. I can't wait to continue working with you. I know you're you're one of the hardest workers that you know we have, and and you really want to get better. And so. Let's use these sort of videos to get better, and then I'm looking forward to seeing you uh, sometime real soon. All right, talk to you later, Drew.